must be the home of the druid. The fellow's land is peopled by men of straw. Finally come! Days ago, a passing cloud foretold your arrival with droplets of sun-scented rain! But what form of being are you beneath this guise of horse and bone? From the realm of the Fae? I know you cannot say. I, I press no more. Whatever you be, now you are here, the ritual may begin. Oh, but the men of straw must announce you with sparks! Ignite the sky to begin anew, here at the death of the season. Until then, I await you, giving thanks in the glen. Aelwyn said that the Wickerman must announce me with fire. Perhaps I should set them ablaze. Hangman's noose, a knife, and the vile smells of poison. Three ways to kill someone. match. Two ladles carved from a single branch. The grooves match. Sabrina watches me from the water below.
This symbol is one I've seen carved into shields and headstones. joins the throng. Another! Let there be cacophony! One more! One more! speak to Eivor, but perhaps he will speak to the spirit of the Mary Lou. With... Speak to me, O oh wind! I have come to ask you a single question. Something about your demeanor and your physical manifestation now gives me pause. Are you truly a spirit of light? I am a spirit as any other. Then prove it. You must know the depths of the world's mysteries before I will help you. Tell me the proper use of charms. Very well. Ask your riddles. Which is the charm that weds souls? The charm of the double spoon. Yes. Such that a wedded pair can sup broth together. Man and woman are made of earth of water and wind. Which charm clods the earth, dries the water, and stills the wind? Threefold death stops life's wind, returns a body to earth, and renders water into poison. Threefold death is the charm. Which charm protects from evil spirits? The symbol of the Celtic knot warts off harm. A secure knot indeed. Only one of light need not fear it. <laughs> you are a spirit of light. Mabon be praised. Would you like some bread and cream? No, just the answer to a question. This herb pouch made its way to Gloucester in the hands of a strange man. You know it. Aye. A mix to help him sleep. I filled this very pouch. And over a dandelion wine, he spoke fondly of his home, Kuth Lodron. Kuth Lodron? <clears throat> Very well. I thank you, Halwyn. But this spirit has others to visit this harvest moon. Go with the wind and leaves, good friend of the hills. Kuth Lodron. Strange name. Meanwhile, Modron awaits me at the stones nearby. Welcome, fair traveler, curious child of his. I am Brendan of Ireland, and through light and voice have these stones spoken to me. Here lies the markings of him, where a second voice, higher than most, spoke to me again. Listen to all I have learned through prayer. Long ago was a great and tragic war. The offspring of gods who lived before the deluge. 
I pray for these rebel angels who came before. How far has the search for me stretched? Far enough to say it's best you stick to the countryside and wear that disguise. But Tefter's body has not been found as yet. That night was full of drink and merriment. I do not remember much, but I had no quarrel with Tefter. A sorry tale. Did you learn anything from Halewin? He gave some herbs to a man from Kuth Lodren, name of Gwilim. He was drinking with Tefter and myself. Kuth Ludren is the Welsh name for the thieves Warren. It's atop a hill west of here. I can lead you. I owe you a great deal for all your aid. You do not have to trust me. Tevder's fate is to my interest as well. This is a troubling development that I hope to get to the bottom of. Let's make haste then. I must find Gwilim and regain my honor. This forest, and all of Gloucestershire, feels untamed. I feel as if I've ridden my horse through a door to another world. Aye, there is old magic here. Old magic that would be snuffed out by Tevder and his church. Tevder did speak of reformation. Do you think that's why he was targeted? There are many who would claw their way to the top. Tevder's disappearance could be the work of any. But you are a witch. Open to wisdom from the guards. Have you seen anything? I don't see much smoke. Are there any rival Danes passing through who could have done it? If it were rival Danes, you would have heard their horns by now. We're not a humble sort. Blunt tongues and sharp axes. The thieves warren. This is where I leave you. You'll find somewhere safe. There's a shrine nearby. If you've need of me, then meet me there. Gods old and new go with you. What do you see, Sunan?
I used to lie down and pray that the leaves would cover me. That I could drag them over me like a blanket and join Jarnunos in a bed of leaves. Took me in, stranger, with a song. The sound of Odin stamping on your bones is the only song you hear. Aid me, be my eyes. Best not to draw attention here.
Make me angry!
I should not be seen in this area. Shit is right. Eivor, you're alive. Have mercy. I were under orders. Elderman Kurnan, he gave us coin to dispose of Tepter. Then he should demand it back. Shit sales haunt you are. Cannot kill a single man. You made a poor choice in scapegoat, Gwilym. And we thought that if we kept the lad alive, we could squeeze Kurnan for more coin to keep it secret. You look like a man who lies to save his own skin. I look like a man up to his neck in sheep shit. Please, I'm telling the truth. Tell it to your guard. Look, we wasn't gonna kill the lad. We've come to like having him around. Tell him, tell him we've taken care of you. Kunan did this? Why? I've done nothing. To... Oh, gods, is he dead? Wake up, wake up. Tell the Dane I've hand fed you like a baby sparrow. Ah, move, fool. Ah! Look, Eivor, we're mates, right? Uh, had drinks together? Remember the chickens? Speak again and I'll take your tongue. Tafter will need to see a healer. The slaughter been smearing dung on his face. Could I even help for ransom by worse men? Thank you for your aid, then. And try not to get help for ransom a third time after you flee. Thank you, stranger. Thank you. It is much appreciated. Please help me! When I awoke in this demon lair, I feared the worst. Save your strength, Tefter. It's a long ride. Kuma, he ordered my death. I don't understand. He's been like a father to me. I will ask him myself. I was mulish when he spoke of the pagans being just as we. Living in kindness, under the laws of many gods. One face, many faces, it matters not. We are all blessed to be alive in his glory. This grave has changed you, Tefter. Changed me. Changed the dressings. I should be cautious around here. He's hot to the touch, and his mind fades in and out, but he lives. Perhaps a sickness of the blood. Shame, shame. He was captured by the men there? They claim to have been hired by Kunan. Kunan did this? I know not why, only that he gave them coin to dispose of Tefter. You can see how well they saw to that. They were alike once, the boy and Kunan. God-fearing Christians arguing the nature of life with me. But he softened. Men do great evil to cling on to power and save their skin. Perhaps he means to put Tevda to flame in his place. Does not the right demand the leader? If he made the lad's body elderman, then it would still be right to sacrifice. Then he's not safe until I've dealt with Kunan. Can you tend to his wounds? I am a very good healer. But if the gods want him to join them, I cannot stop their will. Eivor, what will you do with Kunan? You are resolute, then. 
then may you ride as Rhiannon. Thank you, Modern. And please, take care of Tefter. I must get to Kunan before the festival's end. <laughs>